The Butcher by Gwydion Sullivan was one of the first three plays that we had in our very first New Works Festival. It was a play that as soon as I read it, I called Cody Nickel, our artistic associate, and said, this one's one of them, I'm sure it's a great, great play, and it has done nothing but get better over these two years that we've had an association with it. I have been working on The Butcher for nine straight years. The process began with a friend bringing to me an article from the Washington Post. I can't talk about it because it would spoil the play, but suffice it to say that the article was a tempting source of material. I've really been living with this story for a very long time, and at this point I've had hundreds of people contribute to its development. And then it found its home here in Naples at the Gulf Shore Playhouse. It came to the New Works Festival two years ago, and I fell in love with the theater, and the theater fell in love with the play. We had great actors working on it, helping me really get it almost the last bit of the way there. Uh, great directors, a great community springing up around the play, and I noticed that the conversations that were happening after the play here at the Gulf Shore Playhouse were vital. They were real. They were honest. They were hard, but they were good, and it was, it was evidence that I, I had done what I wanted to do. To create a piece of art that would allow us to have a different deeper, more connected kind of conversation about those different points of view. Uh, I wanted to create a piece of art that would allow people with different beliefs to see themselves on stage, and not just to see themselves to be mocked, but to see round human portrayals of themselves on stage. We don't often see many evangelical characters or Muslim characters or atheists on stage. It's been a really interesting journey, and I cannot wait to put it on our stage. Can I help you? 